What I'm going to do is point through the way that we set up the ankle to perform an ankle arthroscopy and give you a few technical pointers uh, in order to make the procedure go smoothly. This is a setup that we use. Uh, we put a uh, impermeable drape over the uh, ankle and we use this non-invasive distractor. You'll notice that the distractor sits outside the drape so you can even reapply it during the course of the procedure if you so need it. This is a uh, ankle strap. The ankle strap is placed so that the foot is elevated. This allows you to get to the front of the ankle and also to the posterior lateral aspect of the ankle which are the most common portals that you may need uh, to use in, in order to perform your ankle arthroscopy. We look at the front of the ankle. The main, uh, there's a number of neurological and vascular structures which pass across the front of the ankle which uh, you need to avoid in placing your portals. This is tibialis anterior which I've marked here and over to the side is where the saphenous vein and nerve are and this line here represents the deep perineal nerve and over here the superficial perineal nerve which is very, um, is, is quite variable in its uh, passage across this lateral aspect of the ankle. This patient has chronic sprain syndrome which he's had for approximately four to six months after a work injury and you can see that he has quite marked swelling in the lateral aspect of his ankle. In order to place your portals, what I first do is I move the ankle up and down so I can easily identify where the tailor tibial joint is. An incision ma is made which is approximately eight millimeters long and I tend to place it close to tibialis anterior so that I can, uh, I can avoid the saphenous uh, structures. I know that they're not going to be close to the tibialis anterior. You can even sometimes roll the saphenous nerve over your thumb and in this gentleman, because he's relatively thin, I can flick that backwards and forwards. The next part of it is blunt dissection. And I blunt dissect through the fat and I push from side to side in order to push away the vascular and tendon structures in this region in the ankle. Next, I take a trocart. And in this instance, I tend to use a 1.9 millimeter telescope. If you bring the foot up to, neutral, to a neutral position, you'll bring the tailor dome away from the entry point for the trocart. Trocart is then pushed with even pressure and notice the direction which is approximately 60 degrees to the plane of the ankle. That'll then, you'll feel a popping sensation and you'll be able to feel that it moves freely within the ankle joint and you can see it moving over here at the lateral side. You can simply remove the trocart then and introduce a 1.9 millimeter telescope. And in this instance, we're using a three chip uh, video arthroscope. Now you go to inside the ankle joint.